Gabe has done a great job for us. Ramir, who's a senior, um, I can just tell you it's heartbreaking on this end. Anthony had a great week of practice. It's his show now. <laughs> you know, it's time for him to go. It was his show last year, so it's his show now. And they were happy that they won, you know, I mean, I mean, I was happy we won. I just appreciate the fact that a lot of them have belief before they won. Heinrich gets the snap, looks right, gonna take off and run. Heinrich's respected by his teammates, you know. He battled all last year as a scout team quarterback. I thought it was an amazing experience. I thought it was a tremendous crowd. I thought it was great for recruiting, obviously, but it's great for our players, and hopefully great for the fans, and hopefully they like the way we play. As hard as we're hitting people, we got to start punching the ball out. Grass is safer than turf. There's synergy when guys are together. He and I went to the rodeo together. It's not fantasy football. I play guys baseball what they do at practice. A lot of them have been trying to figure out, hey, am I ready? I've just told them, hey, guess what? You're ready. No decision on a starting quarterback for this week. Jeff Sims and Heinrich Harburg are listed as co-number ones. Next Saturday's game against Michigan will be at 2.30. Newest Bolt projections have the Huskers going to Phoenix. That means the experts project at least six wins. And tough news today for former Huskers quarterback Casey Thompson. He suffered a season-ending knee injury at Florida Atlantic. More Husker coverage is available at 1011now.com.